All right, if you guys don't get ready in like the next five seconds, oh, you guys are DQ. Get out, get out, my. Fellas, you want to commentate? Okay. Uh, I am back. Your least favorite person you have ever met. Uh. Riley, do you want to reveal? Do you want to reveal your character now, or do you want to just like guess what you're gonna be playing? Okay. Just, just making sure, based on what we talked about. Or what you what you talked about, I should say. What color? Is it brown? Alright. That's melee, okay. <sighs> now, back... So sorry. We, we have had cringe matchups every single... I'm not- I said- I'm including my own set! Oh my god. Everyone- Everyone's matchup has been cringe. I don't know what you want to say. Except maybe Rob Joker was- Every match- eh, nah. I mean, it's a cringe match. I'm not saying the players are cringe. It's the matchup itself is cringe. <laughs> it's true! Game & Watch Ices. <laughs> I don't know what you want, bro. What do you- why- what- what did I do wrong? Oh. Okay, here we go. Off to a start. Game and Watch doing Game and Watch things. Oh, up bees swinging. Oh. It, yeah, I'm trying to think of something to say. I mean, it's my first time commentating. I don't know what I'm. I'm uh, I mean, um, beautiful pressure, up B, Game and Watch up the best out of shield in the entire game, arguably. Maybe not even arguably. Bailing him out of so many situations. Now, I've noticed a uphill trend in Icy's lately, due to um, ever since Big D's pop off at a uh, Ludwig's um, tournament not too long ago. Even game right now. Oh, D sinks. Oh, beautiful kill. Icy's take first dot at a really early percent too. How well can they play this lead that they now have? Ooh, game watch edge guarding side B up air up air. Up air? Oh. <laughs> Nana gets one, like, one last hit before stock taken. Even stocks right now. Um, listen, yeah, this is a goofy matchup. I don't know anything, like, any specifics on this. I do know Game Watch, some of the Game Watch things. Um, I know Ices are really hard to deal with. Sometimes. Beautiful get out of disadvantage card and down air. Uh, but Ices do have the percent lead by a large amount. Can they close stock before Game & Watch can uh, slowly grind their way back in? Oh, D-Sync's going off. I don't know what D-Sync is called or what. I am not that proficient in Ice Climber knowledge. But oh, I am prefer. Ooh, never mind. Good up B out of sheet. Gonna be up be at a disadvantage actually. Ooh, up smash is swinging. Game and Watch doing a great job keeping Ice Climbers disadvantage. Ooh, beautiful forward tilt. Can stock be found here at this ledge situation? Ooh, beautiful back air. This Ice Climbers is on a mission. Ooh, oh, not the worst situation. Not not the worst. You know. Both are alive. Oh, oh, now this is really bad. Oh. Game Watch trying to keep both separate out as much as possible. Oh, but the grab, the upbeat, separating them both once again. Oh, Ice Bees. Ice Bees. <laughs> ice Seas D. D sinks going off. Oh. Oh, game. Game Watch upbeat once again, proving its worth. Great patience. 
Babo definitely looking like as if he has the reins on this matchup right now. But only 44%. Ooh. Popo and Nana are separated. The Saibi to save the Nana. And to force an alleged situation. Game and Watch dash attack. Oh. Can these two swingers get some? Oh. 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 Oh, it's tense. Not a side B. Ledge pressure again. Oh, beautiful mash on the on the uh oh decent. Oh, I thought that was gonna kill. Oh, and the up smash vengeance. Last stock for the game. Oh, uh oh. And we have Sopo versus Game & Watch for the last stock. Does Babo Sopo kind of, is, is it kind of fight? Is it kind of fight? The side be going crazy. Ooh, Game & Watch, ooh, the fair. Is the Sopo finna go wild? Back air, for, uh, back air at ledge. Icy's back air is egregiously good, surprisingly. Oh, dash attack, disadvantage, but the mash, uh, downs hill. Oh, downs hill, and the Sopo takes game one. Impressive performance from Babo. I have never seen a Sopo win on stream. In person, at least. Beautiful game one on both ends. What is the counter pick? Smashville it is. This Ices is proving to be quite the foe. Alright. Alright. Game two on Smashville. Same characters. Hopefully game one, we've seen some adaptions, some interactions between both players. Let's see how game two rocks out. And off to a side, but you know what? Nothing changed. <laughs> I'm kidding. 41%. I look away with 41%. Ices does shit out damage. I do forget that they do that. Up smash out of shield. The desyncs are caught. Good up B to get out of the desync. I feel like the game watch is one of the few characters to actually be able to get out of certain desyncs that ice climbers can do because of that invincible frame three. But game watch. But Ices are putting on quite the show. Oh, game and watch. Oh, oh, was that a nine? Beautiful recovery. This, I don't even know what's happening right now. All I know is this is an insane performance from the ice climbers right now. I don't even, I don't personally know how this matchup in theory is, but Babo is making it look dominating. Taking the first stock once again. But Yoshi Freak's not going out just yet. It may only say 38%, but Nana's taking quite a bit of percent. Uh, quite a bit of percent. It's 50. Sopo is back. The Sopo is back. However, at freshish percent compared to Game Watch's 10. Good mash on this. Good get out of ledge pressure. Grab. Uh, up air combo. This Sopo has proven to be quite fearsome, but the jump is gone. And oh. And so is the stock, unfortunately. Even stocks. Bro, I think it's not, I jumping on mic too. This is not unfortunate. This is not unfortunate. Everything is going exactly as you think it would. True. Yeah, we got bot. Anyways, I just hopped on commentary. Bobo playing Ice Climbers, Yoshi Freak playing Game of Watch. Should. <laughs> but that's already been mentioned. <laughs> Oh, wow. <laughs> my bad, my phone almost did an emergency SOS. <laughs> oh, wait, Bobbo's up again? Yo. <laughs> Well, I mean, like, you're watching it. Like, you're watching Yoshi. He has to play really, really patient right now in neutral. 
Like, he's playing really patient and neutral, and, like, you know, he kind of might get some of the skills from playing melee, but... Like, he's trying to keep his distance away from both of them. He understands that both of them together are really, really explosive, and so whenever they do get together, he's kind of keeping his distance and trying to... Yeah, like that, just read any part of his mo movements or just kind of do a little bit of a bait and punish. So he's not really taking any big commitments. You see him, like, upping out of shield, too. Yeah. Yeah, Ice Climbers are really weird about kill power. It's like they have some moves that just make you explode. Damn it again. Nah, I, I'd probably just mess with my phone in some way. But. Not bad. So, like, he's not. Like, Yoshi Freak does not have to commit much, and Babo does have to commit a lot, but whatever Babo goes for could end up being really, really explosive just because of ICs and desyncs. As you're seeing, whenever Yoshi Freak, like, actually moves to the side, or whenever he, sorry for that, whenever Yoshi Freak actually, like, approaches, he keeps it very minimal when both of them are together, and then if he's able to split them up, or if he's able to get one hit in and hit both of them, he'll try and focus the other one, or he'll try and, like, make sure that for whoever he targets, that it keeps them split up. And that's actually the way that you would normally play against, like, Ice Climbers back in Brawl and, like, Rosalina and Luma from Ultimate to now. You try and keep that a partner away because the partner and them is what makes it so scary. Anyways, you saw here, Baba was able to get a good straight hit and take Yoshi's Freak Sock. They're not on the last stock and... I mean, like... He... Probably. Bleh. <laughs> Sorry, words, I'm getting distracted. <laughs> I'm like literally like tuning in and out because like as much as I want to like believe that this is like a good game and everything and I want to like spectate with good commentary, like bro, there's two minutes to go. There's two minutes to go. <laughs> Your shield is dead, sir. Oh, no! Dude, that was the real dash attack. <laughs> My dude. Literally, just like, after this, download the VOD, and like, download the entire VOD, yes, and then just trim it down to the exact part of it that you want. Boom, you have your tournament set. It is more work, yeah, that's why you try and avoid it, because, like, bro. <laughs> bro, I swear, you are such a masher, you don't even realize it. How do you mash and forget to record a set, bro? <laughs> bro, Mal, he mashed so much, he forgot to record the set. 